With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, so our question is, Galileo writes that for angle of projection of a projectile at angles 45 plus theta and 45 minus theta. The horizontal ranges described by the projectile are in the ratio of if theta is less than 45. Okay, now the Galileo writes the angles as, let us suppose theta 1 as 45 plus theta and second angle is 45 minus theta. Now we have to tell what will be the ratio of horizontal ranges of the described projectile. Now as we know that the range of a projectile motion is given as u square sin 2 theta upon g correct sin 2 theta upon g now for the first projectile having projectile angle theta 1 so the range will be r1 will be u square sin 2 into 45 plus theta into sorry divided by g so this will be u square sin 90 plus 2 theta divided by g and sin 90 plus theta is cos theta so it will be r1 is equals to u square cos 2 theta upon g let us suppose this is equation number one similarly we can find r2 range for the second particle sorry for the second angle of projection so it will be u square sin 2 into 45 minus theta upon g so it will be u square sin 90 minus 2 theta upon g correct now we mm, sin 90 minus theta is cos theta so r2 will also be u square cos 2 theta upon g let us suppose this is equation number 2 so the ratio of the described ranges will be r1 upon r2 will be u square sin 90 plus sorry sin not sin cos we have calculated as cos 2 theta so it will be u square cos 2 theta upon g divided by u square cos 2 theta divided by g so the ratio will come out as 1 okay so from the option option number 3 that is 1 is to 1 is the correct option for us. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.